controversy over a candidate's push to get his nickname printed on the ballot. Labor Commissioner Leslie Osborne wants her opponent, Representative Sean Roberts, kicked off the ballot because he wants his name to read Sean the Patriot Roberts. He claims it's because she knows she will lose the election. Well, today, the challenge went before an election panel, and News 4's Austin Brissett was there. He joins us now live. And Austin, tell us what happened. Well, Kevin, a verdict is in. Representative Sean Roberts will remain on the ballot. However, it was ruled that he will have to amend his name to take the Patriot out from in between his first and last name in the run for labor commissioner against incumbent Leslie Osborne. The state election board has ordered the contestee to remove the words the Patriot uh, from the original declaration of candidacy. After a couple hours, the state election board ruled that the Patriot is no more for the ballot in the race for labor commissioner. I'm not surprised they, uh, they, they ruled to had to change my name. Um, I disagree with that assessment. I believe that back in my area in the grassroots, I'm generally known as the Patriot. It was all about ballot integrity. Uh, for somebody to pick a nickname just a couple of weeks ago and then say it's something you've been generally known as, which was the uh, actual state standard, didn't seem fair and it seemed like something that might be a gimmick. Former Attorney General Mike Hunter, who represented Commissioner Leslie Osborne, called it not consistent with ballot integrity, using Oklahoma Administrative Code saying Roberts is not, quote, generally known by that name. We just believe in election integrity. Hunter added that it was Roberts' campaign slogan, and he called two current Republican House representatives to the stand, Chris Kennedy and Gary Mize, who both said they have never heard Roberts called by that name. Hunter also brought up the point that Roberts has not used that name in the previous seven elections. I believe that what they, what they believe as far as me being the Patriot and what I've done up here at the Capitol, fighting for their freedoms, uh, pushing legislation that will maintain our freedoms, especially in the Second Amendment, are true. Roberts, though, saying he's been known by that name for years, saying around 200 to 600 people know him by it, providing a birthday card from someone who said he was truly, quote, the Patriot. Also calling current U.S. Senate candidate Jackson Lawmeyer to the stand, who says he knows him by, quote, the Patriot. She did not win her case. She wanted me off the ballot, and I'm still on the ballot. So I look at this as a victory. We look forward to the contest. Well, Roberts amended his name just after the ruling came down, and the board also ruled that he is going to be responsible for the fees for that hearing.